just in time for National Pie Day. Today, Abilene's Life of Pie now has what they call a new salesman and a unique way to get Abilenians their dessert, a pie vending machine. This vending machine has blown up on social media. Our Annabelle Tuggle spoke to the owners about how they can hardly keep up with restocking. Key lime, chocolate, and even chicken pot pie. I don't feel like you can get this in the grocery store, the quality of their pies. Desserts from Abilene's Life of Pie that Susan Hall has loved for years. And now she's able to get it a lot easier than before, even when the store is closed. A pie vending machine, um, that's that's actually pretty cool. Uh, definitely something new for Abilene. People were, were uh, commenting about what pies were left. The idea behind this vending machine sparked as a way to offer help to owner Leslie Bivens during a time of staffing shortages. Our newest salesman is right out front, that vending machine. And bringing in extra income to help with inflation affecting their business. PFG, our food vendor, gets here on Mondays. I have to kind of take a deep breath and look at the price of my egg. We're right about $55 a case right now, which is still uh, about $30 more than a year ago. But Bivens says this vending machine blew up in a way she would have never expected. Well, I haven't slept since. No, I'm just teasing. Uh, we were we were blown away. The first weekend this vending machine was open, they had to restock twice in one day. And that's because Abilinians are raving about this unique opportunity to get a freshly baked pie. I got banana pudding. I was like, that's so cool because I don't necessarily like crowds. Kendall Pixler stopped by to satisfy her pregnancy craving, and the pie was also able to keep her son happy. Which she says is a win. In Abilene, Annabelle Tuggle. He was crying, now he's not. KRBC, Abilene's local news. Thanks, Annabelle. And with today being National Pie Day, the lines at the shop were extremely long because the owner says Abilinians take Pie Day very seriously. 